All right, this is part two. And I got this for TikTok's sake. You know, we can only go 10 minutes at a time on TikTok. Hallelujah. And I will, yes, yes, yes. You must be born again of water and spirit, Jesus said. Hallelujah. Now, Romans 8 and 5, they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh. Galatians chapter 5, verse 19, the works of the flesh. A whole list of sin. Uh -huh. Walk after the spirit and not after the flesh. You're walking after the flesh, you're sin. You're walking after the spirit, you're not sin. Oh, God's spirit. Jesus' spirit, born on what the watching spirit don't have you sin. It don't lead you to sin. Glory to God. Hallelujah. You must be born again of watching spirit. The spirit come from the spirit of water, come from the Son of God, Jesus Christ. You don't believe Jesus Christ, Son of God? You ain't got no spirit, you ain't got no water. You have not repaired your sin. You're sinning every day. You don't have no spirit. You don't have no walk. But God's spirit don't lead you to sin. Jesus' spirit don't lead you to sin. Jesus' water don't lead you to sin that he give you. Uh -huh. The word of God don't lead you to sin. Jesus don't lead you to sin. Except you born again a water spirit, you ain't going to heaven. John chapter 3, uh-huh, begin with verse 3, and keep reading. Except a man is born of water, and the spirit, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Jesus is that living water that you probably give that woman at the way. Hallelujah. If you don't have the spirit of Christ, you are none of his. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Let's go there. You must be born of water and of spirit. Let's go, let's go back there. John 3, it said the man that born of water and spirit, he can't see the kingdom of God. All right. Let's go back over here to Romans 8. In verse 1, there devil now no could didn't make the deal with the Christ Jesus who walked not after the flesh, not walking according to the sin nature, but walking according to the spirit. For the law of the spirit of life in Christ, the spirit of life in Christ, have made me free from the law of sin and death. I don't have to bring no psychic, no sin off of it every, every once a year now. I don't have to give to the priest. The priest don't have to offer his sin no more. The priest ain't got to go behind no veil no more. I ain't got to pay no time and offer no more for my sin. Which never took away sin no way. All right. But what the law could not do is that weak through the flesh. No thing could, could help you, couldn't make you, but could wash your sin away. The blood of an old thing could wash your sin away. Hebrews chapter 10. But God sinned in old song. In the likeness of sinful flesh. For sin could deal sin in the flesh. That the righteousness of the law might be fulfilled in those who walk not after the flesh, don't walk according to human nature, sinful nature, but after the spirit. The spirit nature, God nature, Christ nature. For they that after flesh do mind things of the flesh, you of the sin nature, there was a man on the sin. You ain't no Christ. You ain't a Christ sin. Your man on sin. You are not a Christ. You are not a Christ. Glory to God.
They that have the flesh do mind things of the flesh. Your mind don't sin. Your mind ain't no pleasing God. When God say go sin no more, you say no, we human. See where your mind at? Ain't nobody in public. See where your mind at? Jesus said, be public. Your, your mind said, ain't nobody in public. See where your mind at? You, you ain't falling out for Christ. You're not born again with all the spirit. Born to be calling the mind this death. Calm. Sinful desire. Fulfilling the lust of the flesh. Now go to Galatians 5, 19 and see the whole list of sin. The flesh is sin. Sin and but to be spiritual minded is life and peace. We call the call of minded is enemy against God. But you know you fight God. God tell you what to do and you say, well, you can't take script and live. Well, in every in the scripture. Well, we all got sin. Look at you fight God. Look at you. God say, tell you what to do, and you make excuse for what for, for not doing what you said to do. Yeah, but we all human. Look at you fight God. God said, Jesus ain't gonna go see it no more. And you fight that. You call the call of mind is even against God it is not subject to the law of God. You ain't subject to the law of God. You subject to the law of your father, the devil. You submit to Satan, not God. First John chapter three, he which I mean, I'm sorry, John chapter eight. He that commits sin to the servant sin. That's what Jesus said. You submit to sin. You are servant of sin. You owe your father the devil. So then they that have the flesh cannot please God. You ain't pleasing God, sin. You're not you you're not you're not pleased God with the obeying the simple human nature. What about the spirit nature? Well you not you are not of the flesh, but 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 in the spirit. If so be the spirit of God dwell in you. Now if any man have not the spirit of Christ, he is none of his. Back in John chapter 3, barely, barely, you must be born again, except a man is born of water and spirit. He cannot see the kingdom of God. John chapter 3, you ain't going to heaven if you're not born of water and spirit. If you're not born by the spirit of God, you are not going to heaven. Water and spirit. Christ is a, Christ will give you that living water. Christ give you his spirit that don't lead you to sin. Act do the opposite, leads you not to sin. And your nature is not to sin because you have Christ nature. Well, we still human. You deny that. You deny, you deny your human nature. But you have Christ nature. Your mind ain't on sin. Your mind don't please in God. Except a man that born a watching spirit. John chapter 3. He cannot see the kingdom of God. Walk after the spirit and you won't fulfill the lust of the flesh. Walk after the spirit of God that's in you. You be the spirit of God that's in you tell you to sin. The spirit of God that's in you going to tell you what God said. Mm -hmm. The Spirit of God ain't gonna tell you that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. The Spirit of God ain't gonna tell you, you don't see. That what the Spirit of God ain't you gonna tell you. That what being born again the water the Spirit, the, 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 the new man that born of God, not of your mom and dad. Shabbat. That's why G, that, that, look, 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 that, that why G, look, Jesus wasn't even born of Joseph and Mary. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God. But it's by the Holy Ghost. The same with you. The new man, the, the, the new man ain't born by your mom and dad. 
Thank you, Babir.